All right, number 13 to 16 are the problems you have not learned yet. So let's see what you can pick up in the next few minutes. In number 13, we have a problem about a stained glass window. We need to understand that a circle has 360 degrees. See how I drew one in there? If you look carefully, there are eight angles the same size as X. So you just take the 360 degrees divided by eight to find out that each angle is 45 degrees. The answer is C. If you would make a cut the way it is shown here with the dotted line, and you take off the top piece, you would end up seeing a rectangle. And the answer again is C. In number 15, parallel lines create relationships between certain angles. If you could see there's a triangle in the middle of those three, actually four lines, and the 48 degree angle uh, actually is also in the triangle, 48 degrees. So what I did next was I removed the triangle, I redrew it outside of the four lines, and I put in the angle measurements. And we need to understand that all three angles of a triangle have to be 180 degrees when they're added together. So I set up an equation, x plus 48 plus 72 equals 180 degrees. So I solved the equation by getting the x by itself, and I found out that x had to equal 60 degrees, and its answer is C. Number 16 is about a circle with a diameter of 6 feet. That means its radius is only going to be 3 feet, so I can use the formula for area, A equals pi r squared, where the radius is 3. So you square the 3 and get 9, and be 9 times pi would be your answer. Letter B. And that's it for our multiple choice activity for PSSAs. Do your best on the test.